We all know the power of social media and how it can be used for good, but in the wrong hands, it can also be very, very dangerous. This power is not lost on cartels, who are harnessing the power of social media to attract migrants eager for a new life in America. These posts present an idyllic picture, ignoring the risks and the reality of human smuggling that can come at a very high price. Joining us now with more on this is News Nation West Coast Bureau correspondent Nancy Liu. Hey, Nancy, we've been hearing about these videos that these cartels have been putting out, promising all sorts of things that are not even possible. Mm hmm. Yeah, and they're pretty remarkable, Elizabeth. As you know, the cartels, they've been using social media for decades, but now migrant smugglers and illegal criminal influencers, they are using higher production techniques. They're getting savvier and they're posting some pretty slick content on YouTube and TikTok. The videos feature similar themes, smiling migrants making it to America safely, going from a hard life in countries south of the border to a prosperous new life in America. Social media is where is that right now? And they're having a tremendous amount of success doing that. Some videos have racked up millions of views, luring migrants to find the $10,000 or more to join in the excitement. And heavy editing makes the illegal path to get in look more like an adventurous vacation. And they make it sound like, oh, come on this journey and we're going to get you the mix uh, to the United States from whatever country you're in. Uh, but they don't mention all of the risks that they're taking where they're, they're going to get apprehended, they're going to be uh, held hostage at the stash houses, they're going to be tortured, they're going to be, be beat up. They're, they don't talk about the risk that, that they may even die. This TikTok account has already been taken down by the platform, but according to Robert Almonte, new ones are popping up all the time. Gracias. Gracias. And the cartels are said to prefer human smuggling over drug smuggling since migrants are forced to pay up front. Drug payouts aren't made until the contraband is delivered. And for many migrants, there is a tragic ultimate cost. Now, it's estimated that the cartels are making over $13 billion a year on human smuggling alone. Both TikTok and YouTube responded to us with requests for links to those suspect accounts and videos. Elizabeth, this is something they are constantly working to combat. Wow, $13 billion a year. Unbelievable. Nancy Liu, thanks so much for that report. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.